Hello, grade 8, here Mr. G, and in this video, it's going to be a short video to practice how to draw molecules, okay? Now, last videos, we saw how to draw atoms. This is how to draw molecules. So, they are different things, and please do not confuse them. Let's start by set uh, or define a molecule. A molecule is a combination of two or more atoms. Combination of two of more atoms. Example. Example of molecule H2, Cl2, H2O, HCl, CO2. This is just some example. There are many, but this is example. You can see in this that you have more than one atom in the molecule. For example, in the first one, in the first one, in these molecules, you have two atoms of hydrogen. Two atoms of hydrogen. If we go to the uh, second one, we have two atoms of chlorine. We go to the third one now, the third one, this one, we have two atoms of hydrogen and then we have one atom of oxygen. Okay, let me just make this one a little bit bigger. There we go, there. So, we're going to go back. Molecules is a combination of two or more atoms. Okay, remember the atom. Remember the atoms are represented in the periodic table. The periodic table represents elements, and those elements are made of atoms. If we go to this example, these are examples of molecule. Obviously, there are many examples. I just giving you some examples. The first one is the molecule of hydrogen. This is not the periodic table. This is a molecule. So in here. You can see that you have two H's, so two atoms of hydrogen. The second one is Cl, also from the periodic table. You have two atoms of chlorine. Now, in the third one, you have here two atoms of oxygen, of hydrogen, pardon. There you can see it. And you have one atom of oxygen individually. So you have two hydrogens and one oxygen. All right, now that is the first important thing we have to learn. What are molecules, all right? And what are atoms? They are different, okay? So, now let's go to the second part. We have two types of molecules. Let's see, molecules. We have two types of molecules. One type is a diatomic molecule. Now, a diatomic molecule is a molecule that have two atoms of the same element. The word di here, di means two. This means two. So, two atoms of the same element. For example, a diatomic molecule, example of diatomic molecule will be H2O2. And two Br2. There is more, but I'm not going to write obvious all of them. So you can see that you have two atoms of the same element. Yes, you have two atoms of hydrogen. Here you have two atoms of oxygen. Here you have two atoms of nitrogen. And here you have two atoms of bromine. That is a diatomic molecule. When a molecule is made of two atoms of the same element. All right? And then the second one is molecule of compounds. Molecule of compound. When there is two or more different atoms. This is two or more different atoms. All right? This is same atom. 
Now, example of molecules of compounds are um, H2O, CO2, CO, HCl, and there are more. There are more, but I'm not going to show you all of them. There are too many. And you can see that in these a specific molecules you have, for example, hydrogen and oxygen. So you see that you have two different atoms. Or you have carbon and oxygen. So in each of them you have two or more different atoms. Now, this is related to molecules, or more or less everything you need to know about molecules. Drawing molecules, and molecules are the combination of two or more atoms. Examples of molecules are this one here. You have to be able to identify the atoms. We have two types of molecules. We have two main types of molecules. Those are a diatomic molecule. They are made of the same atom, made of the same atom, and you have molecule of compound. There are two or more different atoms. They are coming from different atoms, and you can see some examples. There. Now, how to draw these molecules? Now, let's, for example, let's, for example, let's say activity, and the activity say draw the molecule of, and I'm going to give you two, H2 and C. O2. Alright, draw the molecule of those two. The first thing you have to do is to write the atom, the molecule you have with symbols. H2. This is the first molecule we have to draw. Now remember here we are not going to be drawing atoms, we're going to be drawing molecules. So each atom will be drawn with a circle. Okay, for example, H2, we have two H's. We have one H and another H. And each H will be drawn with a circle. So these are two atoms of hydrogen. But in a molecule, they must be close to each other. So the two hydrogens are going to be touching each other there. You will have the one um, atom of hydrogen. There's one atom of hydrogen. And the other atom of hydrogen must be touching that one. So this one is the atom of hydrogen. Each of them is one hydrogen. All right? So this is one atom of hydrogen here together with another atom of hydrogen. This makes the molecule of H2. You can see two atoms of hydrogen. I hope that is clear. Now, the other molecule we have to draw is CO2. So now we have two, uh, two oxygen and one carbon. So each of them are going to be represented with circle. For example, one carbon or carbon, we are going to represent it with a circle and then a C inside. This represents one atom of carbon, which we are going to fill, but it doesn't need to be filled. This is one atom of carbon. And oxygen, oxygen, one oxygen, eh? one oxygen will be represented with an O and a circle. We have now atoms of oxygen. Here is the atom of oxygen. So how do we make the carbon dioxide? First of all, the one that is single is always going to be in the center. So carbon is going to be in the center. And the one that you have more than one is going to be around the carbon. Here is the carbon. And then the oxygens will be around the carbon outside. You have two oxygen there. This is one oxygen. This is another oxygen. So this here, this here is what we call the molecule of carbon dioxide. You have one carbon and two oxygen. This one here is carbon dioxide or C. O2. I hope it's understood. It's not difficult. It's important. There is molecules in the test you're going to do uh, soon. So please practice. You can practice with any of these molecules here. They are not very difficult. Thank you very much. I hope it'll help and uh, good luck.